Are you there? I am here. All right, we're back. Technical difficulties. You know, Peter did something wrong, obviously. Yeah, it's always Peter's fault. Yeah. Oh, it always happens when we come Can't down to watch it. Watch the stream. And have a good day. Just kidding. Not yeah. Peter's fault. I guess we'll explain it something, when. Uh, as people come back in, we'll, we'll kind of explain it, I guess. And oh, wow. We lost everybody. Lost everyone. Man. Peter. I keep throwing it at Peter. Back in action. All right. Cool, man. Good to hear. Good to hear people joining back. If you guys didn't know, it seems like for, for absolutely no reason at all, it didn't give us a warning. It just shut us off. And it didn't even shut us off. It shut you guys off. We were still talking. We were still over here having a good time. But it just it just decided to stop showing up on your guys'. So, yeah, it was so, something about the content or something. Yeah. I don't know. Set max time out. But, but we had just restarted the stream. To, yeah, it wasn't like, we were only thing. like 45 minutes in. Oh, pretty good there. The Turner's looking at a one rail at this two ball. Even if he does go one rail, he's got to get a look on the three, even if he makes this two. <laughs> Matt, Matt's mom pushed the wrong button, cut us all off. She, she apologized. Yeah. Um, Look at Chris Adams. Chris Adams scoping out his talent and Justin Turner before their big match. He's over there with a notebook taking notes of his of his opponent. I see what you're doing. See either that or you're just like pool. <laughs> Can't be just like a pool though, right? Going for the one rail. Oh wow. You don't know where it came from. It just shut us off. All right. Yeah, no. I don't think we were cussing or nothing. <laughs> I might have. Hey, you never I... know. It's a bad natural habit. Like the norm. I apologize. Oh yeah, hey, no, I think uh, I think it was just weirdness. Could have been, you know, they shut us down for music sometimes. They shut us down for this and that. Anyways, back into it. Jack of four to zero. I'm gonna steep on this three. Technology. Yeah, you're right, Roy. I'm with a lot of safes. Jack is here. He, uh, yeah, and Jack he's been successful like he's with them. Trying to win. Yeah, he does look like he's trying to win here. Like what he's doing. He's even though he's up, even though he's up, he hasn't taken his foot off the pedal. He's really uh. No, it's right on his neck. <laughs> he's keeping the pressure on Justin here. I like the one real kick. Good chance for um, a safe right back. Are you saying one rail kicking over by the four? Uh, long rail. I have no idea. Pete has no idea either. Good, good hit. Mm. 
All right. Well, getting on this four is no walk in the park here. So what's your decision here? Um, you might cross this over. The nine's in the way for the cross, ain't it? I don't know. I can't see. He's in the way. <laughs> I think the nine's in the way yeah. of the cross. I think. Uh, well, I mean, if you even try to follow it, the top left, you're probably going to run into the nine. Yeah, that's what he's looking at right there. Dave? I don't know. He's got to get way down the table. He might just take his medicine and make it. Nope, going with the safe behind the nine. I like that a lot. Wow, what a shot. Just nestled that cue ball up on that nine. Incredible shot there. He's come with really good saves back yes. to back to back. He's really you know, coming with it. It's so huge getting froze to the nine. You know, if you leave even a half an inch, he's got an easy one rail. Yeah. You know? On the side. No, it's just your Jack Circus pace on his safes have been absolutely phenomenal this set. It's this match. Absolutely. It's not horrible. Oh, no. You know, it gives him, he's got a little room to cut it in the side. Jack's got some traffic. Got to get around the 10 and the 9. He can choose to cut this 3 in, but he's got some traffic for sure. I don't know, I don't know if he can hit it full enough to miss that 6. Six or the 10. What do we know? Wow. He could hit it full enough to miss that six. That's a great shot. Hit it too good. Yep, yep. A little bit too much pace on that. Of course, he had to play a little pace to avoid that six, I he think, did. though. All right. Yeah, it seemed like everything shut down, Tom. We don't know why. Hopefully, it's the last time. Maybe it's... Maybe it's Kurt playing all this music on the jukebox next ju jukebox next to us. <laughs> Does it matter if I sing? Oh my gosh! No, because <laughs> because it would have to be close enough to the way an artist does it, uh, I can't or a singer. That is not and, me. Great shot. Trying to use the nine. Oh, that'll work. Good shot. Even though it came out a little bit. What, Jack? Couldn't freeze him that time? Ah, no. He's just put constant pressure on him back to back to back. What do you like here? Obviously, there's not an aggressive option. You mean, do you like an easy bank? I mean, you could try towards and the it. five, send the cue ball around two rails down between the nine and the ten. Oh, thank you, Kelly. We appreciate you so much. Eleven. Um, I kind of I like that trying to get on the nine, just like that. Watch the pace. Hey, that's oh. like <laughs> that's like the third great. You guys are awesome today. I'm on I, fire. I know, man. It must be you. I'm gonna. We're gonna have to put that on our resume. <laughs> I would have to be in the same key. <laughs> wow, he hit that really good. Yeah, he hit it just like you said. That was a great shot there. Jax? Going with the one rail at the four. One rail bank. Watch this. <laughs> that was... I think that's where that one pocket comes in. Can you see them do a lot of like kick bank? You know what I mean? Like when the ball's at the other end of the table, you know, in a corner, there's multiple. Can't believe I'm starting to like that game. Oh my gosh. Brutal. 
Is he going for the two two way bank on this one? Is that what I just saw? Look like he called the bank. He, Am I wrong? He did. Looks like he's going for a two way bank then. See how it maybe he trying fires. to use this use the six? I don't think you're firing it. I think he's using he, the six just in case he misses it. He gets crazy sometimes. He might fire oh no, he Oh no, he's, he's trying, trying to use to the five. Save. How do you hit it? Well, yeah, he was trying to use the five with inside. That's yeah, got a little too much, really. They hit that end rail and just shot to the side instead of, you know, coming up longer towards the five. Yeah, had a little extra sauce on that a little, shot. A little extra juice. This ain't no picnic. You're probably gonna run into the ten, so getting on the five is gonna be difficult. Probably gonna have to stay long. Oh. Another good lead by Jack. This one's going to have to do some defense right back. Somehow. Yeah, constantly putting a ton of pressure on Justin Turner here. Making him come with it over and over again. This game has lasted. I mean, this game has been going on since the stream died. Right? It might even have spotted a ball. <laughs> oh, I can't with you, bro. You might be able to kick this side from the side rail, hit the four thin, and dip it right up under the five. Just like that. Wow. Wow. He hit that good almost. Almost. <laughs> well, you know, if he, if he oh, can no. hold it closer to the rail, he's under the five. Oh, yeah. With that same shot. So oh, that yeah. Very good shot. Very good. Looks like he's got a little bit of an angle here to come back for the five, huh? Yeah, I think you don't think he's that. straight. You don't, you don't want to overhit it and risk scratching. Just, Look like, you know, it's weird. It looked like there's a lot of spin on the cue ball, but it's really just a high ball. It's really strange the way that that ball was spinning though off that rail. Yeah. But he just went straight high ball, maybe. A half were were you watching it in person or on the stream? On the stream. That's why I go back the stream, and forth. You're, you're, you're at a different angle. Yeah, you're right. You're, you're watching the cue ball from a different angle. You're right. You're right. You're well, that's I'm on a roll today. We're, you we, are on a roll. We're, we're going to keep track of these for the highlight reel. It was, a, it was that cinnamon roll you had earlier, man. Oh, That's good. the roll you're on. <laughs> Very good cinnamon roll, by the way. All Peter says, apologies for the stream going down. We're working on it, which means he's sitting at the bar drinking a beer on standby if it happens again. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Love you, Pete. Where is he? I'm telling you, sitting at the bar drinking a beer. I promise you. I don't see him in view, but... You know what? I don't Did know. Did he actually get out of here? He might have got out of here. I don't know. Uh, kind of came on the funny side. Gosh, that is, that is seriously the worst case scenario there. No picnic. I don't think. I mean, that's really the worst. On the line of that cue ball, that's the worst spot for that cue ball to be. It's not unmakeable. Well, yeah, if it's down rail, he cuts it in the corner easy. If it's up, he cuts it in the other corner. That is a, that's a 50-yard line right there. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Just peeking at Justin Turner, I can kind of tell that the fatigue is starting to set in a little bit. He looks good, but kind of tell he's kind of just sitting over there drinking his coffee. He's kind of pacing back and forth. Also, it almost seems like a nervous energy, something I'm not used to seeing from him. <laughs> nope. I think I nailed Or maybe some get the blood flowing. Yeah. Or 
it's been a long way. It's something, something that, uh, something that's worth mentioning. It's, well, he's been, he's played back-to-back -back matches, so. Oh, yeah. Fatigue is definitely a factor in these long tournaments like this. Yep, so this is the quarterfinals. The winner of this gets to play Nick Sapiti for the semifinals. The winner of that gets to play Matt Hardwick sitting in the wow. finals. And He's that will be a... in this cross corner. Wow. All in the bank shot. I think I'd try punching it to the corner either way. Yeah, clearly uncomfortable with the shot. Burns says, love and miss you guys. We love and miss you too, bro. Who do we love and miss? Uh, pretty good there. I didn't see anything. Did you see them, or is he just messing around? That's <laughs> Chris Adams. I don't know. Get that dude out of the arena. Oh, that's going to line up right for the side there. Yeah, you know, Chris, like, it, it kind of looks, guys, really not, like, I don't know. It's, it, it's a bit deceiving. shorts. Every guy in this yeah, bar know, right? is in shorts. No, he's talking over here. He's really not. I mean, he's standing at the entrance over there, or the gate. But oh, he's it, blocking it. Yeah, it's, it's really not a, yeah, I, it, as I much as it appears on camera. The... All right. X really starting to feel it now. I have a feeling the shot clock is kind of going to come into play in this one. The stream does make it look like they're right on top of that guy. Oh yeah, see that? Oh yeah, he's Jack's a good... sitting on his lap right now. Yeah, all right. No, he's a good seven feet away from him. He's comfortable. It's just it's just a camera angle. Yeah. No. Nah. What in the world? No. Oh. Something Justin Turner does really well is he, he takes advantage of me. Takes it takes advantage of mistakes. Okay. <laughs> I love <laughs> she's funny. He's, he's, like, so like, are you doing okay? I'm like, like, yeah, we're good. Talking with Mega, read my lips. Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. Like, if you could turn up the volume on reading somebody's lips. That What's your I, You know, I've seen Justin Turner shoot enough. I think this ball's dropping, Alex. Oh, no. Your favorite pocket. Yeah, but he just missed that one. He, that that you know misses what? on any you table. Did, even say anything about it so what's that tell you I don't there tell is no commentator curve i think that, i think i think that tells me that fatigue is starting to come into play for justin here he's got to find a find a way to tap back into the way he was playing on that other table of course justin doesn't know how to play until he gets down five games <laughs> he's shown us that really? oh that's coming right to the bottom rail though Justin's a little frustrated by that. I think he you can... know what? Since I've started to a little bit enjoy one pocket, I've learned like you know four railer stuff like that. Oh yeah, this shot 
Four rail all day. Stop it. Seriously. Like four rail. Ask, ask Chris Adams what he would do in this. Chris Adams. Yeah. He's four railing it. I like thinning it off the left side and coming up table. He's four railing it. If you come off the left side, you got to thin it if you do that. If you can reach it, thin it, come off the left side, two rails, two rail to keep all up. Oh, uh, Chris would just bank it straight up there. Lou says four rails. Who said four railer all day? Yeah, Lou Lick knows. I just went with Adams. He heard you. <laughs> just went with the cross there. Jack still got to come with a shot here. Yeah, I think I'm with Lula. You, you, you do the four railer and you come up short, you're safe. <laughs> you got uh, in your four railer. Uh, seriously, it's a, it's all about percentages. This ain't no fun here. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, par box, Tommy. There, there's no limit on the amount of strokes you're just charged per stroke. On your tab. Uh, Chris Adams says 70-30 on the shot. Well, there's the 70. Great shot there from Jack. Going up 5-0. to zero. Looks like Justin's going to take a quick quick break. He's down 0-5. Just yeah. like he, he was down 1-6 to six on the other table before he caught a gear. So he's got him right <laughs> where he wants him, Kurt. He, right where he wants him. He got him. Got him in a corner. Yeah. Jack's shaking in his boots. You can tell. Straight back Jack. Yeah, so just... This is a winter break format, Jake. Yeah, you're still here, man. Yep, you're right, John Sanchez. This is when Justin starts playing. That's what he did over there. He was down 1-6, to six, I believe, Peter winter... said, and came back to 9 and one nine six. Break. One eight in a row, I believe. See, J John knows when Justin starts. Always lurking. We hear you, Jake. We hear you, man. Jake's, Jake's an interesting character. He's got some good one-liners, too, man. He's one of those kids. You, you ever meet those guys? You know, you ever meet those guys that just, like, like the young kids coming up, I know I'm 28, man, but the kids Dude. coming up, like just Dude. out of high school, you oh, can't even understand. Yeah, you can't even understand what they're saying. You understand the words that are coming oh, out I of know. my mouth. No, what? they got they got all this new lingo, saying like, "Oh, oh, no, I heard I heard a kid the other day say no cap' in a literal sense." I was like, I was like. First of all, I had to look it up. Second of all, I'm like, this is ridiculous, bro. All right. Jack to break. Looks like Justin's back to break. Jack has been successful at making things on the break. Hasn't always had a... Extremely successful look on the one, but <laughs> Ooh. 
going through a jump. I like it. Is that what he's doing? Yes. Yeah, Justin didn't even budge. Just gave him a little head nod. Go ahead. Tell you what. Justin's a bit of a I grinder, was, man. He's kind of... Uh, the pros play, and guy pushed out to a jump. The opponent gave it back to him. Made it ran out, won the set. Then they interviewed him after, and he said... Uh, Right, right move is to give it back on For, a jump shot. Yeah, like push it out to a jump shot. No, some jumps are really easy. Well, yeah, but I'm not saying really easy. Mm -hmm. Nothing's easy, but sometimes when it's hanging and you and you got a and you got a comfortable bridge to jump. Hit me with it, Kurt. What do you got going on over there? Well, apparently, Jack's having some uh, perspiration issues. A little bit. <laughs> oh, that is so funny, dude. He said his armpit feels like a lake. <laughs> Oh my gosh. That is so funny. Oh, oh, it must be. Oh, yep. Five to nothing. Yeah, Justin starts playing when he's down five to nothing. Yeah. He, like, he likes to give him a head start. Yeah. That's what it seems like. Guys, he needs the pressure, man. Well, this, this, this table is a humbler. Oh, yeah. What's up, Martin? All right. Well, let's see if we can get something going here. No oh, cap. Stop it. <laughs> I swear to God, bro, we're not doing that. Keep you in your. Are they still called millennials? What happens? What's after millennial? What's the newer one? Is there a newer one? Oh, I don't know. Whatever generation. You don't is. want to know what I call them. <laughs> let's we'll let's get, keep we'll, this viewer we'll friendly this for everyone. Shut down again. Yeah, that, that was your fault, bro. It was not. Gen Z, what Jake says. Yeah. It's funny, at least someone knows. You know, it's funny, we started making those jokes because that's the way Jake talks. Like, he says some stuff that I just or don't they, understand. They, they talk in... They talk like... It's almost binary. Oh, yeah. Well, they, <laughs> well, they, or, well, they, they talk do, like, like so much... BYB. Or, oh, yeah. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. They talk text. Oh, yeah. That's what it is. It's text talk. But he also talks so much cooler than me. Oh, he came up a little short. He's, he talks so much cooler than me. Does he have an accent? Is he British? No. They talk cool. No, he, he, he just, he's just one of those guys. I want to move to Australia and learn how to talk the way they do. He can talk about filing taxes and make it seem like the coolest thing you've ever heard. Oh, he's from Australia. Oh, no, man. He doesn't have an accent. That's the only way. Just a... Uh, Probably just just some weird you. kid. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right. Tough cut for Justin here. Trying to get himself back in it. He is down five. This is when he starts playing. Oops. Ah. Uh, just let a few get away. Safety. Just a reverse safety. <laughs> I would, I'm glad you enjoy it, kid. Yes, I am 28. You met me when I was 21 and I first started going to bars. And you're the reason I got into pool, really. Or started playing more competitive. Oh, I'm sure you were 21 the first time you went to a bar. I was, dude. You. Man, I was way too much of an anxious kid to try and sneak into a bar at 21. Not buying it. <laughs> it was the first time I drank.
Oh, how about this? Is he going to use the 10? Uh, at least he got down to the bottom rail. Pretty good shot there. Left distance. Left it tough on Justin. Like the shot. He likes, he likes a challenge. Oh, yeah. Something about Justin. He did not back down, and he absolutely loves the challenge. Free railer. I want to watch some bank pool. Apparently. Watch Jack play enough. It's like watching bank pool. What are you saying? He doesn't get good shape? Or what? Saying he's not opposed to banking balls um, on any table. All right, let's see what Justin's got here. If he takes this one on, it's likely going to have a bit of an angle on the nine if he doesn't, after if he makes this eight. He hit that pretty for him. That is a tough table. Yeah. About as good as you can hit that ball without it going down. We do here try to go around, get on the other side of the mountain. Three rails or. I like what he did there, but a just lack of execution on that shot. That's a pretty intricate safety. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't. I don't think I want to know that one. Brutal. <clears throat> All right, what do we got? Yes, they are, Jake. These tables are vicious. Nope. Oh. Nope. Oh, got a good match. Justin Turner, master of the comeback. Jack Circa just playing his butt off right now. Really playing well. A different Jack than we saw that lost earlier. Jack's yes. really, really yeah. playing, coming into his own. Playing real good safeties. We're in for a bit of a longer, longer finish down this one, Kurt. Um, yeah. Big jump winning this match to get to your next one. Oh, yeah. Money starts really Everyone compounding after this. Get... Asking for a little reinforcement there to make sure that it was good. Hit it well. I just missed the shot. Oh, how's his pace? How's his pace? How's his pace? I tell you what, I'm glad I'm not shooting this shot. I think you have to take it on, but I'm glad I'm not shooting it. You like this shot here? No, I cannot stand shooting past the side pocket. Oh, let's see if he can do it. Really difficult shot. Seen this one rattle up all day long. Now that I say that, I guess this one should drop. But this is a big game here. 
Uh, a great shot. How about the cue ball? Uh, wow. A little close to his work there. Well, this looks familiar to one of my matches. The 10 <laughs> ball. Yeah, make the 9. Get right on the 10. Yeah. I would... It was a hill, hill, and almost freeze to the 10 ball. Oh, no. And I got a 90-degree cut. Is that what knocked you out of the tournament? No, that's the one match I won. Oh. <laughs> no, I won two matches. First two. Oh, what a great shot that was. Wow. Going up 6-0. Big start from Jack. Only going to nine. He needs three more. Haven't really had, hasn't let Justin Turner in this match yet. Justin's had his opportunities though. He just hasn't quite capitalized like we're like we've seen him do all day. I, I think that last match where he came back from came back from one six down, I think that took a lot out of him. And coming back into Let's this. Let's do one, the math real quick. His last match he was down six one. Yep. Comes back and wins nine six. That's a three game leeway. He's down six zero instead of six one. So that's one game to the worst. So he's still got a two game cushion. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Yes. You're right. You're telling me. Well, hard to say. Jack's playing pretty good too. Really hasn't looked super lopsided. Just kind of seems like thumbs down the last few balls. Jack's come with us some shots. Justin Turner's missed a few shots late, and it's just that's been the difference. It's Peter. He is at the bar. Oh, that's where he lives. Yeah. Every once in a while, he visits his wife over at her house, but this is his home. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, well, that'll work. You know, watching these guys play, they play a lot more. I think it's six, right? It's Yeah, that's six. It should be. I, I just don't think they've updated the score yet. Right. It should be six here in a second. Well, he should be the one updating it. I know. Did he, did he ask you if it was six? Trying to get on that 6-7. Uh, uh, disrupted it a little bit now. No, whoa. not enough. It's available. All right. Jack with the three in the side here. Going to let his cue ball loose a little. Yeah, they got to adjust the score. The score is actually 6-0. to zero. I don't know if Tim can hear on his end. Maybe he can adjust it. Otherwise, we can tell Jack in between games. Tim lost the instructions. Do what? Tim probably lost the instructions. <laughs> and Peter's at the bar. It's a call, Peter. Yeah, it's six. 
I think we'll get that. Hey, look, somebody fixed it. Hey, I think Tim fixed it. Boy, that Tim, he's something, isn't he? He's something else, man. What would we do without him? Score keeping capabilities. Well, let's just <laughs> let's just figure out what he is first. What? <laughs> what does that mean? Well, he said he's something else. Oh, <laughs> you're hilarious. <laughs> Every once in, Tim listens to our commentary a lot, so every every time we say something about him, we give him a little glance over there to see if he heard us or not. I don't think he heard that one. <laughs> not yet. It is on a little bit of a delay, so we can say it and then give him a minute. Yeah, Tim is on it, running two huge tournaments this weekend. You're correct, Chris. Uh, big shout out to Tim for, uh, gosh, I want to say now, correct me if I'm wrong. I want to say he had like 40 teams in the scotch or something. Or was 43. it 43? 43 teams. And then we had 31 players for this event. I mean, yep. you think about that 43 times two in the scotch. 43 times two 86. in the six. 86. I was plus 31. Yeah, let's, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> or 10 plus, let's just put it that way. <laughs> Math, bro. Math. That might have been easier to calculate this morning, but after after engaging in this for the better part of eight hours, with likely another four more, five more, really. Two and a half a match. You know. Well, once you get down to Matt, things really start to speed up a little. Matt Matt's got a lot of firepower, likes to likes to play at, at a bit of a pace. Oh, look at this. The five needs to get there. The five needs to get there. Oh, that glance off the nine didn't get there. That's going to be ball in wow, hand. Wow, that's a, kind of a reverse from yesterday when they played. Jack did that to Justin twice, where he came up a millimeter short from hitting the rail. Yeah, you mentioned that a few times. Wow, oh, he's getting really steep on this five. He wants to make sure he can get really steep on the six. And look, perfect. <laughs> well, I thought the six was overran that a little bit. Now he might be forced to bank or play safe here. Like I said, if I bank like Jack, I'm banking it. Oh, yeah. That's there, but it's a really thin cut, and these pockets aren't forgiving to, for the cut. Pocket plays a little bit bigger on the bank. He's going He's safe. Go this this going thin on, route. Going under it. Did that pretty good. Sure did. Didn't get a lot of movement out of the six. Ah, uh, is this one going to leak out? 
I think it stayed tucked up under there a little bit. Yeah, sure did. I think Jack's going to have to two-rail kick under the six. Maybe even one rail. I like two here. I like two. I don't really want that six to hit the nine on the way out, though. Oh, did he call that? Wow, that is that is an amazing shot. With the two rail made it in the we side. We got some highlight reel action going. On. We absolutely do. Wow, what was that? You see that? Overhead lights turned on. Yeah, just for a second. Someone's got some money on Justin or something because that was right when Jack was getting down. Oh, it rolled off. Well, we're uh -huh. looking at a pretty much a do or die situation here. <laughs> I remember my first bank shot. Dude went nuts over there. That was a bank shot he made? Oh, I'm kidding. I don't know. Some guy's going nuts in the corner over there over something that happened on his table. I imagine it. I imagine it's some guy that just made the first bank shot of his life. You know how they get. Yeah. All right. This is to get Justin on the board. Really looking at this one. Ooh, don't jinx him now. Oh, pretty good. Ah, this has got to feel pretty good just to get that first one out of the way. Really feed off of this one. Obviously got a long way to go. Jack still needing three. So Turner has shown that he can put, put a few together in some of the best in this tournament. The thing about Justin Turner, he's not going to give it to you. It's every single win you're going to try and earn. You, you got to earn it. He's every. He's here to win this thing, yeah. and and in his mind, he absolutely believes he can come back from here. Not the kind to get down on himself when he gets down. Yeah, I mean, if if you look at it this way, backs up six zero, six one, yeah, or he was up six zero. Yeah, yeah. Why can't Justin win the next six? It's very you true. <laughs> he just got up six. It's very true. So never give up. Never, never, never. Oh. See the change in the break? No, I haven't seen a change in the break because just you the turner hasn't it? broke. <laughs> he broke once. Did he? Did he break to start? No. <laughs> he, he lost the light too. But no, yeah. I was going to say. say you're like a change in the break. I'm like, just the turner uh, hasn't uh, done a whole lot of breaking recently. Obvious what he did. He's breaking with his playing cue, not his break cue. Oh. Boom. See if we can get something going here. Yep, everything's there. This rack lays incredibly well if you can get past this one. Looks like it's straight in if it goes by the seven. I think he's but done. he's looking at the cut. <sighs> so it probably doesn't go by the seven. Probably go straight up and down. Yeah, 
Yeah, everything's available from here. The three passes the six, the four is hanging, the four to the five is obviously easy, the six is hanging, seven's not bad. Crack plays. Look at him sprinting good. around the table. Second win. Oh, it's the coffee. <laughs> you think it's the coffee? Justin may be stretched out on this next shot. Let's see how it does for him. See if he can reach it. Watch him do it behind the back and draw it back. Oh, he can make it. Mm, um, the crutch. He's going to have to draw this back. Yeah, very difficult to do with the bridge. On the, other, the four is on the other side of the table. Yeah. He does have a good backboard, though. You know what I mean? Or if he... I don't... I think it's just the miscue. Sure. I think it's just the miscue on these draw shots. They're very difficult. You really, yeah. Bridge makes it tough. That might have came out enough. Yeah, I think he, he can cut it for sure. I mean, it's thin, but he might have to let his cue ball loose here. Yeah, it's almost natural around the 7 and the 8. Yeah, I think you're right. You know what? He died off that first rail, didn't it? Yeah, you know what I think he was trying to do? I think he was trying to hit it and hold it with that inside off that second rail, and then he didn't get the result he wanted. Because uh -huh. I don't think there was really a reason That's to play thing. inside if you're coming around. No, I think he was trying to play that shot where you hold it off that second rail. No, no. Not going to get it down there. And Jax, I want to see heavy favor to get out from here. Oh man, what was I think I should have him get me one or what you're doing good? Do what? I told I told him no thanks. I should have him give me one <laughs> Oh yeah. How long you been announcing? You sound very tired. <laughs> yeah, only eight hours. It hasn't been that long. We've done we've done much longer. <laughs> Plus, we're sitting right next to Jack, so maybe it sounds like we're tired when we're close to him. Oh, we're I trying to whisper. I definitely am. We were here till 2.30 last night, and we're back here at 9 this morning. Oh, yeah. With almost two hours of driving in between. Oh, yeah, you have to drive a lot. Now, do you do you jack up and kind of, I don't want to say jack up, but punch it a little bit I, just to get closer to the nine here? Well, I think you some left. cut it in with some left and. I guess you don't have to jack come up. Come around it's, and you know three rails. I guess the left to can get closer. Yeah, I guess the left can get you get you there. He's actually further off that rail than I thought. I thought he was closer to the rail where he had to jack up to get to the center of the ball if he wanted to, but he's not. He's calling the bank here. I'm really surprised by this call here. He's just going to stop the cue ball. I know he's good at banking, but I'm really surprised by this this call here. This is yeah, miserable. he's going to stop the cue ball. Great shot. I mean, if you can bank like that, it's not wrong, right?
play to your own personal strengths. With that said, that was crazy. <laughs> I agree, Chris. Bank to Circa. Open even on Sundays. Yes, you are correct, Alex. That is hilarious. Straight back, Jack. Yeah, yes, sir. All right, shooting into our favorite pocket. I can't believe you do that. This pocket is... What, that bank? Hey, it works. I was asking how to come around, how you'd come around three rails. Yeah. Thank you so much, bro. Yeah, that, that pocket's getting in their heads a little bit. They've missed a few hitting that rail on the way in, and now they're trying to overcut it to, they're trying to overcompensate and miss that rail all the, all together coming down. And it's ended up coming right. a little bit. Yeah, absolutely. That's a bit of an overcompensation, I think. I think you just get a nice, easy cross side bank, try to leave the cue ball on the end rail. I would try to do. I like, yeah. Oh, uh, how to hit it? Nope. I don't like what he did. He tried to keep his cue ball down on this bottom rail over here. Made, made sure that he's going to have Jack earn it. Jack's been pretty good with these shots recently, even though this is no walk in the park. He's got, he's got extremely straight cueing, especially when he's feeling it. Can't help but think fatigue is starting to play a factor in some of these guys, but I really think... Uh, maybe... I like Jack's odds to make this. Nope, going with the safe. Apparently, Jack didn't like his odds to make. No, <laughs> that's a good a... shot, though. That's no. I think that's that's, that's the smart, right. That's the right shot. Though. It's the right shot. I've just seen. I've seen him take that shot on, for the most part of today. It's one of the few times he shied away from it. Kind of surprised me that he didn't go. With that I one. think it comes back to the pockets. Yeah, you know, I think that is a little timid. Yeah, that's the right shot in the circumstances, especially where you're at. This, I'm four railing this all day. You and your four railers, bro. <laughs> Chris says this is the time to go for the four railer. I think he's saying come a little bit wide off that fourth rail or off that last rail and then get the cue ball all the way up. So you run your cue ball around. About four rails. Run your time you guys catch up. Oh, shut up. <laughs> so you, you bank the, he's saying bank it four rail. Yeah, I come a little short with the 10 and then I bring think the cue ball up. Cue ball four rail. Oh. Well, I don't know, man. I. If you don't like your money. <laughs> well, clearly these guys are in it to win it. Hero or zero? Mr. 100% and Mr. 4 rail. Hey, you got a name now, bro. <laughs> you got one. Yeah. I already had one. I thought he was Tim Daniels. Oh, yeah. I've got a few names in here. I've heard it quite a bit. Let's hear them. Oh, oh we're good. Wait, what? A hundred percent. Get Mr. Joey Ryan. Get get Justin Ryan, or I get Joey Ray. Ah, <laughs> uh, he's gonna leave it. He wants it to get to that rail. No. Nope. As routine as this, yeah, this is routine enough for Jack. It's not comfortable. It's not comfortable queuing. It's not a comfortable shot. That's easy enough for him. If 
four rail this one just to show them. <laughs> well, I'm looking down the barrel. It's less of a cut than it looks like on, on, it's on the green. Cut, yeah. yeah, it's That's like it's nice. almost straight, believe it or not. And the pocket in the looking stream, down the... it looks farther from the pocket. Oh, yeah. No, oh, this is no gimme, but no. he's heavy favorite. Got... He tried to not make it. All right, that's going to bring Jack up to seven. Really? Easier in this pocket. Yeah, this <laughs> you might pocket, be right. Yeah, we don't see a lot of hangers in this pocket. You know, we could just be, we could be creating a false narrative about how this table plays tighter in one pocket than the other, but it feels like it. <laughs> well, call us the news. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. There is too much news out there. Chris says he loves the other pocket. Yeah, when it's your opponents. What's that? <laughs> yep. Yeah. What we do. All right, seven one. <laughs> you know that guy? No. No, oh, yeah. All right. Me and Peter had that conversation once. It's like once you put on the headset, everyone wants to talk to you. <laughs> huh? Yes. I'm oh, taking a break. I'm gonna take Peter's five. here. I thought you were supposed to go home, Pete. Beer just beer was too cold, huh? Yeah, it's funny how that works, huh? <laughs> You uh, called me down at 12 o'clock today I, for a camera issue. Shut up. I just didn't, I couldn't find the power button. What right. time is it right now? Is it, am I reading that correctly? 7.30. Yep. We still got another five hours. What's going on, Chris Adams? How you doing? How's everybody else doing in the chat? We got 120 in here right now between YouTube and Facebook. Heck yeah, dude. If you guys are on Facebook side, you want a better way to view it too um, and see all the old matches and stuff or archiving everything on YouTube. Uh, Donkey Pull Productions over there. Yeah. We're also currently, like I said, live. Yeah, give, give us a, a subscribe over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, see, Jake's been, it's, it hasn't been as fun since since you haven't been in the booth. Jake's been giving me a hard time, but now that you're here. I thought I banned him can, last time. Yeah, you know what? Must have been like a, must have been like a 24-hour ban, because here he is. He's back. Old j Dunk. All right, I'm getting my phone out. Sorry, Jake. See you later. <laughs> reported <laughs> <laughs> well i hope everybody's enjoying their sundays thank you guys for joining us on your valuable time and every time we do the live stream on saturdays we get about like a quarter of the viewers because you know people got stuff to do all that jazz it's saturday at least degenerates skip church on sunday to watch <laughs> pool so that's kind of cool beth how you doing oh my gosh where have you been i know where you've been sitting at the bar there ain't no way you're, I just came in here right now. You're just telling me I like <laughs> hey, that. Hey, man. Wow. You know, I got to give you a hard time, bro. You stuck me in here with Kurt. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I really enjoy Kurt, man. Kurt's been great. I've been great, though, Beth. I hope everything's been well with you and your son. You know what's funny about Kurt? He looks like the angriest dude on the planet. Like, he does, he's just yeah. Just a giant teddy bear, bro. He like just... he's like so unapproachable. Like oh, he, yeah. he's like don't want to talk to him, oh, and yeah. he's like the nicest guy in the world. Oh, we're doing that, Jake. Oh, I better not indulge in that conversation. Oh no, my, yeah, we're not. Yeah, we're shutting that down. Hey, hey, Jake, you are banned. <laughs> Final straw. He told me he was moving away. By the way, Jake. Yeah. Ah. Uh dated every girl in town he just can't handle the pressure you know he's got to get out of phoenix shot from justin right here that was that incredible. Just great shot hooked on that rail what well, time is the tea time <laughs> what time is your tea time 7 a.m on the dot where are you going uh we're gonna go play bull play blow play play blow yeah oh, cool. which is crazy because it's like a really fun course to play but they always like just don't care like take care of the course which is a bummer the oh, course yeah. could be so so nice anyways we're playing pool here though just landed so you're already like out out are you gone for good bro is he on an airplane talking to us <laughs> oh, <are> you? <laughs> whatever 
All right, opening salvos here, pushing the one ball around. I think Justin might take this on if he can see all of it. Oh, they've been very defensive thus far. I think Justin might try to create something to get back in this match, though. He might be right. Yeah, if he can see all this one ball, he's going to take it on. Oh, nope. You can see most of it. Nice try. Oh, just for a little bit. All right. He's like, yeah, just for the next eight years. Yeah. No problem. Yeah, look, I'm I'm pretty much flat with this one and one and cue ball. It's gonna be tight. Seeing a safety here, probably taking the cue ball up on the nine ten. See enough of that one? I don't know. I don't know. Probably I don't know. swerve it a little. Yeah. He can he, either he goes for it, he goes for safe. Like it's not a huge swerve. Yeah, he. Even though right. it didn't look like that swerve, I think just the spin and being jacked up on the rail a little bit that spun a little bit. Yeah. That's all he needed. Fairly natural because that's where your cue ball needed to come, anyways. But he didn't have that straight on with center English. Yeah, for my spot, it looked like that was pretty well covered. Oh. But I'm Jack. It was kind of funny. Last week we had Tony Circa on the on the on this table in the finals. Now we got Jack Circa making a. Making a charge. <laughs> Got the brothers making some solid appearances on this table. That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah, between the two of them, they've been on the live stream a couple times, too. Oh, yeah. Did you get any messages from Casey? Where have you been? Oh, I definitely had a couple phone a calls. <laughs> hey, Casey, if you're listening in right now, Justin said that. I didn't know how to... <laughs> You were like, oh, I'm just, I'm just here to check out this camera and get this fixed. <laughs> And I see you six hours later. Hey, Pete, what are you doing here, man? No, I'm glad I stayed, though, because that, that stream going down and all that jazz was kind of bizarre. I don't know what happened there. Oh, yeah. Probably happened in the finals. He'll probably be till he'll it's always be Sunday. on the tough 10 ball. He'll be in his backstroke, and the stream will <laughs> shut down. Yep. How many times? How many times? We probably, uh, okay, so, like, we probably live streamed together, like, 50 times, 40 times, something like that. Not enough. Yeah. What are the odds on Sunday around six or seven o'clock? It's just like, yeah. Well, it's important, but goodbye. Anyone want to bet the finals? Nice shot, Jack. Same game. I don't know, Julian. Does that mean you're going to take Matt because you don't know who's going to make it to the finals? And and by the way, that that means my answer is no. Oh, I appreciate you, Beth. Thank you. I'm telling you, man. I This is why I stepped back. No, shut <laughs> up. Stop it. Jeez. So, the important part about this rack is if this nine goes back into this corner, it's going to be, I can't tell it's going to be tight, but I think it does. Oh, what a shot. We're going to stop what? <laughs> No, uh, no. Oh, yes. Yeah, stop it, bro. Beth is like one of my original OGs, man, from my oh, Masters my League. Where she's from? Um, I mean, originally from here. Uh, Beth, are you? I think you're still out in Phoenix. I think the sun's out in one of the Carolinas or somewhere over there on the East Coast for uh -huh. military. Oh. Uh, I really. <laughs> oh yeah! Like the yeah, the pity comment right there. <laughs> Justin's so good at what he does. No, though. stop! Incredible. It. Shut up. He needs to try for the PGA commentary, man. It's he doesn't wild. Make me, he doesn't make me blush. Shoot! All right, big shot from Jack right here. Island, stay down. Oh, this is huge. This is to go on the hill. Yep. Oh, it's a good shot. Incredible shot. Really good. Fairly full hit on the 10 here. Born and raised in Phoenix, yep. Always like on the 10. Born and raised in Phoenix, all yeah. right. Beth is like one of the OGs, man. So you must already have skin cancer. <laughs> <laughs> or a good tan. Uh, everybody out here. What do they say? Like 50% of people get skin oh cancer out here? Oh my gosh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Live on the surface of the sun, dude. Um. All right, that putting Jack on the hill, yeah? Am yeah. I reading that correctly? Eight to one. Nice. 
He's out in Japan. I remember you like kind of talking that he was going to go out that direction. Good for him, though. Hope all is well with him. He's a good dude. Julian, I thought you were out in Phoenix, too. It sounds like you're in Washington right now. You're missing the sun like that. Oh, you're in San Francisco? Oh, pretty much the same thing, then. I am the same boat, Julian. As much as I hated, like, dude, this July on Phoenix was horrible. But it was... I don't like cold weather. I really don't. I like rain. That's about it. Come on, man. It's a dry heat. Yeah. It's a dry heat when it's uh when it's not raining though for two months, when it's supposed to be raining, yeah. it's miserable. It's the fun it, It's the funniest thing in the world when people talk about Arizona heat. They always say, Oh, but it's a dry heat. And it's like my mom left her shoes in the car the other day and the soles of her <laughs> shoes melted off. And she's like, What happened to my shoes? Uh, dry heat. Well, it's no. usually by like the end of July, August, we get like awesome rainstorms. So it's like the like the plus side. What's so. a furnace? Yeah. I good break on Jack right here. He's got to figure out this one ball. Is Justin Turner commentating while he's playing? I'm gonna go ahead and uh, give give you a firm no. No, is this, that, this, is this that is... a nod towards me? No, oh, towards no, you. No, this is Joey the, Ryan. This is a. Uh... This is the less cool Justin. My name is Justin Ray, otherwise known as the Great Value Justin. You can find me. There's no way you can find me in the back room. There's no gotta, way it's you gonna just associate. said that. Oh my god! I'm gonna call you that from now on. You said it first. Great Value Justin. No way. I, I made that comment earlier when people were talking about Joey Ryan. I was, I was like, oh no, I'm the Great Value Joey Ryan. Oh my god, that's great. Yeah, my mom's a rookie. I couldn't catch all that one. Trying to piece it out. He wanted that one ball to go past the nine, I think. Let's get all the way downfield. Well, I tell you, man, this is about as down as I've seen Justin Turner in a really long time. I, yeah, he's uh, not sitting pretty over there. He, uh, he's, he's, he's... Is that you? I don't think so. Kind of like Sullivan. Got any kids running around out there? I mean, you know, Sullivan's <laughs> kind of a common last name. Maybe I did order food. I think I did. Oh, no, I did. I totally did. Starving, actually. Uh, I appreciate you, Randy. Thank you, man. Do you know Scooby? Yes. Oh, okay. Well, then you know. Is Jack wearing earbuds? He's wearing a earbud. Uh people people keep buying <laughs> <laughs> I know the perk of the job. Yep. Hence why I'm still here after six hours. <laughs> I know. You're like, well, I guess. I even tried to go cash out and I got served the beer. And I was like, okay. <laughs> right. right. Oh, Jack, what a rattle. Nice shot though. Nice try. Oh yeah, Chris. That's a rookie move. You don't leave Kansas soda in your car. That's a. That ain't it, Chief. We'll see how this rack plays out. It's kind of a duos of getting on the right balls at the right time here. None of them are tricky, but if you get out of shape, it's not going to be pretty. <laughs> Julian, I appreciate you, man. That's awesome. We had a good time over at Main Street after I, I think I finished like third or fourth in that 625 and under and we just sat we sat at the bar just had a had a lot of fun i remember that oh chris yeah the can of soda so like i went back home to california and um my older brother he borrowed my car and left a can of soda in there and it was so blown up that i swear to god if i touched it it was gonna blow up i'm so glad it wasn't out in phoenix so that thing would have been like a, someone murdered a soda can in my new car <laughs> oh, right. I got lucky. Just seeing some. This is like a drill here. The eight to the nine to the ten. That is that's a super common pattern you see in this game. Ah, uh, damn. Yeah, real short on that. 
Wait, get enough of that one. I thought he almost had the angle to draw it back and forth. Maybe it was a bit too steep for that. Oh, he, he takes care of us, JR. I, he absolutely does. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. John, I do have the overhead cam figured out. I just got to figure out power. So it's either going to be battery packs or if we can get um, stuff wired. We're great. Yeah. And the hard part is we got to be going eight to 12 hours at a time. Yep. The really wonky thing. So, John, to clue you on this, our biggest issue that we're running into right now. So, the close table above the light is not wired. I mean, it's directly wired into. Um, power on the far table 12 actually has a three prong above it. So I think a worst case scenario, depending on what table they choose for that tournament, we're going to do, I think in like three weeks. Um, if they choose this close table, we'll just have them rewire the power on the top for a, an outlet up there. Really good speed there by Jack. Really good speed. All you can really ask for out of that shot. I sure think JR, he's, he's probably reading the comments now. He, he sees you. Um, um, where's this ball going? I think he wanted it a little bit steeper than that. All Look right, Pete. Could we be looking at our semifinalist, Jack, through this run out? Could be. This is a big stroke right here on the seventh. That's me. Yeah, sorry. Thank you so much. That's a little early to call it good already, but... Yeah. It's going to be a strong stroke on the seven, or we're going to play it top. It's kind of a moderate stroke. He's opting for top. Issue is you're going to, this 10 ball might come into play here if you don't get around it. Stroke. Yeah. Bit of a, bit of a poor stroke there from Jack. I haven't seen much of that from him today. Doesn't look like a lack of intensity either. It just looks no, like maybe yeah. it's lack of execution there. He still looks like uh, what I appreciate about Jack is we've seen a few players when they get up, they kind of kind of open the door for their opponent. But what Jack's done well is is maintaining the same time between shots, analyzing highest highest probability, highest percentage on each shot. It's extremely difficult to beat. Oh, Chris, you guys are playing on this close table? Okay, we got to figure out the electrical on top of the light, but that's nothing big. We'll figure it out. Nothing bad. I'm excited for it, man. That's going to be great. Ah, that's what that table kind of bites you. This 10 ball is going to get real big right here. Real big. 10 got in the way. And on the right side of that thing, too, Jack's got his work cut out for him. The 10 did, yeah, the 10 got in the way. He might be able to see the left side of the 8, which doesn't do him any good. Yeah. Maybe you can try and cross it. I almost like picking it up. I don't know. I don't... Yep. Jack's getting down quick. Oh, he's just looking at it. Okay. I thought he was about to shoot that damn thing. He's trying to mass A this thing? I just, I don't know if there's, if your mass A is rewarded. I mean, the best thing you get is. Yeah. The nine dump. ball is so tucked on that side rail over there. It's, it's not, it's difficult. I, you got to come with some speed and that takes away from your mass A, right? Yeah. Blow right past your point. It looks like he's kicking. Let's see, Let's see if he's glancing off the side of it or be, trying to come behind it. All right. And balls in Justin's court. See how it goes. Yeah. Again, this nine ball is not pretty. I like that analogy, Pete. That's a good one. Oh, if, I, if, I'm down, if I'm down when Jack's on the hill like this, it's like, hey, dude, you got to get these three balls or you lose pretty much. You know, that's Jack's in a really good spot right now on the race. Oh, Just man. great stroke. Yep. Uh, Chris Adams, if you could tell me the date on that, I think it's the 28th. Oh, I'm just reading it right up here. here. Yeah. Oh, it's 24th, 26th. Okay. Gotcha. Yeah, I wanted to say it was a little bit later than that. 40K too. in the middle. Yeah, we're going to be live for that pretty much the entire time. Yeah, I might have I'm actually taking time off work for that. Are you really? Yep. Nice. 
Oh, it's maybe gonna go. <laughs> oh, that's gonna that's probably gonna do it here. Yeah. See how Jack maneuvers this ball out of his pocket, though. Again, remember we saw this ball a little bit earlier when you and I were talking again. That ball was so deep in there. There's not a whole lot of options you get out of this. Yeah, it's past the jaws. You just got to back it up. Yeah, I think he's got enough to catch the side rail a little. You think so? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Just play some left. Come out a little bit. Just you are yourself off that rail. Correct. So, this is going to do it. Jack Circa. About to move on to the semifinals, playing uh, Nick Sapiti. The winner of that playing a straight race to 13 finals for 18 grand. How about that? Jack wins 9 1. So it looks like, uh, Chris, you said 28th of 30th on that. Um, Chris is playing actually Justin. Is it Justin Turner? Yeah, right? The person is on this table. Uh, Jack Circus. So Justin Turner's out. Jack no, for the, the one pocket thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. 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 So, yeah, we'll we'll be live. I mean, we have so many dates coming up here. Um, oh, yeah. We'll figure it out. All right. Next up, semifinals. Do you want to input that? Is Pete? that what's going on? No, you got it, man. You're running this, you this show now. You're coming from the guy that had to call you because I couldn't find the on button to the camera this morning. <laughs> you know, quite honestly, I'm also sitting on the couch and...
Oh man, we were muted, Kurt. We missed. Oh wow, they missed you know some what? of the best commentary. Oh. oh, I don't even remember what we said. Thank you guys. Thank you guys for pointing that out. <laughs> I don't mess with it. We were just seeing if you guys would miss us. Oh yeah. No, they were. You know, I swore it was on at the beginning of this match. Must have hit a button. Thank you, guys. <laughs> I wonder if I did. Man, you guys are savages in the chat. We're sorry. What are they doing? It's like you actually want to hear our voices or something. We missed two whole racks. You got to be kidding me, Kurt. We had some great conversations. <laughs> We're oh. Our first one was our first good one. Yeah, our first good one of the day. You guys missed out on a ton. Oh, so the whole time when we we're we missed the whole first part. Oh, oh, we were just talking to each other, Kurt. <laughs> oh well. Well, yeah. Good it's talk. We've had worse. I did that for twenty minutes one time, and then someone's like, "Hey, Justin, aren't you? Are you commenting?" I'm like, "Yeah." And they're like, "You there?" I'm like, "Yeah." Can we get a little play? <laughs> Sorry, guys. It's Kurt's fault. You know whose fault it really is? Pete is the only one it's who mutes gotta be it. Pete. He's fault. the only one who mutes that. I, I don't mute it. It's got to be Pete. We'll blame him. <laughs> Stop it. Look at these guys. They're just giving us like... <laughs> <laughs> God, bro. Oh, you know what? I hate each and every one of you guys. <laughs> oh. Comments off, whatever. <laughs> An apple chart? Um, do we have any phone charges? I'm sorry, I don't have anything on me. Yeah. Uh oh, sorry. Sorry, brother. All right. Well, I guess we better start commentating for real. Notice how the viewership went into decline when we started talking again. <laughs> did it really? <laughs> Just kidding. Probably did. Anyways, let's uh let's touch on a few conversations that we had already had. Oh man, that was um, Jack trying to cheat the pocket yeah. there really cost him overthrew that ball a bit but uh okay so i had a so i was talking to you a bit so based on what you've seen kurt from this tournament so far we're down to the final three this is the semifinals. winner plays matt hardwick i believe that's how you pronounce his last name he's been absolutely on fire uh but from what you've seen so far i i like jack he's um he's really been playing it's solid. like a different jack. He does you look know, like a different jack. He's uh, his safety locking them to the balls like yep. that is just oh, it's incredible. Hmm. <laughs> Taking that the A ball goes. <laughs> oh yeah yeah we could be like, yeah, taking calls right now yeah we'll just hook up the phone to uh, one of the mics and put you on speaker <laughs> where's Peter he could probably do that ah uh, Nick had a few of those. Ooh, he, he's having a flashback of his last match. Yeah, he's gotten down early in both matches. One he wasn't so fortunate to come back from, and uh, this one already about to. Well, I think I'm rail first, just kind of medium. 
You know, this one, I think it's, I think you the ball's I mean? out enough. You might be able to actually hit the yeah, ball and play a high ball. And come straight back. Yeah. Just like, like that. Speak it's not control. straight back. It came back at an angle. Yeah, he played a touch right out. Yeah. Kind of steep on it. I'd much rather be above the ball than underneath it. I like that above angle better than cutting it this way. I find for your peripheral vision, this is a much more difficult shot. When you're above it, you can see kind of the pocket opening a little better. I've mentioned that in the past, right. I, at least for myself. Yeah, at this angle, the pocket, the biggest at this angle. Oh, what a shot. It really does. Awesome. Hit know, that with confidence. He had a good see what I mean about Jack? Oh, yeah. You know, it is a different Jack. Yesterday, when I watched him, he was uh, struggling a bit, missed a couple of 10 balls, you know, rattled him. And... Playing a bit more timid? Yeah. You know, some of his safeties leaked out. All right. Early 3 0 lead for Jack. Taking a. Kind of how he started off against Justin here. Picking up right where he left off. Jack to break. He's had a pretty good break this tournament. One of the better breakers in this tournament. He uh, Not making the same ball consistently, but making a ball consistently. What I've seen. Of course, I had to say something. I apologize for all you Jack fans, but I shut that break right down. <laughs> all right. What'd you do? Oh, I said he's making a ball on the break a lot. And yes. the only thing that he... I figured once I said that he was going to scratch on the break, but he just didn't make anything. So only proof me half wrong. Look at, look at Mr. Peter. I'm only going to be here for half an hour. I'd love him. He's sweating the action over there. Or he's just sweating. Who knows? He's got a perspiration thing going on, I think. Yeah. He told me not to talk about it, though, so I'll leave that at that. What do you think about pushing the four into the five and then putting the cue ball behind the seven? I like that. Like that? I do. Just like that. Really good shot there. You'd like so, to be a little yeah, closer to the seven good, to take away the yeah, jump. Still good. So. I don't know if he can reach the jump. That's quite a stretch, even for a guy as seven foot three like Jack. On his knees. <laughs> Seems like it. Good enough. Oh, oh, is he trying to I'm kick between the seven and the red? Wow. Didn't know there was See, a gap there. Got it, though. Yeah. JJ, the finals is one exciting long race. race to 13. 13. For all the marbles for eighteen thousand five hundred dollars, plus the thousand you're betting on the side, plus the thousand you're betting on the side, plus the auction if you're in the auction. Well, I don't mind saying it, Jack. I, I think uh, Nick's. On top of being a touch demoralized, I think the fatigue's really setting in here, man. I This is a different Nick than, than the one that beat you. Maybe he needs a different shirt. <laughs> He's on his third shirt today? Is that what you're saying? Well, the does second live... one today, and he had two yesterday. Does he live, uh, does he be, live close, or does close. he travel with a suitcase? I want to say I've been to his house, but he might have moved since there, and it was... 
a bit of a drive. Like, uh, I'll check this out. Going with the three rail, three rail, Jack. Oh, and he made it. What a shot. Wow. What a great shot. There we got Jack. to do the highlight reel. He's going to be oh, busy. Oh, man. We've had, we've had a, yeah. we've had a really exciting few matches here. We've had a lot of highlights from this. Looks like he's got the angle and might have to pop it just a touch. Yeah. Guess the angle wasn't quite there. I think he had a little bit more room in that pocket that maybe he could have come above the six or maybe glanced off the top of it. He just. Try to thin it in the right side, come up around. I'll tell you what, I, I do. I'm glad I'm not the one shooting at that eight ball, though. That eight ball is in a tough spot. I wish I was, because it mean I'd still in the tournament. <laughs> Very true. Very true. Boy, you got to be careful what you wish for, bud. Seen more racks lost on that eight ball than one where it sits. Yeah. A lot of balls. I still your favorite pocket. Especially in my favorite pocket over there. Going two rails at it. Oh, solved the eight now problem. You see that eight ball? <laughs> Not a problem anymore. But look at the six ball. Oh, look at, see, we're making it big time now that we're getting the spam in what? the chat. Man. Oh, is that what that is? Oh, yeah, no doubt. No. Well, we ain't got fans in Jamaica. <laughs> I'll get shot there. Rackley's really good to get out from here. Eight's hanging. Nine to the ten ain't easy. I mean, ain't hard. It'd be just fine. This would be to put uh, Nick on the board here. Like a little bit of an angle. There you go. You like a high left ball two rails to yep. the center? Yep. All right. Great shot. Unless it goes in the side. Oh, if that went in the side, he might have just quit. I mean, he's just had some yeah, hard, I hard ducked, luck. I would have ducked for sure. He He's might a... be behind this bullet through glass, but <laughs> it could do damn. Oh, yeah. No, this should be a good match here. Yeah, Nick's been Still playing well. Them. He's just going to tap into the way he was shooting that got him here in the first place. It's still early in the match. Oh, it's very early. 3 1. Used to seeing a lot of swings. What? My goodness, Kurt! What do, you, what do you got going on over there, man? What do you got going on over there? Hey, I cough. I didn't want to cough into the mic. Blew out my eardrum trying to avoid your cough. <laughs> oh, what did it? Oh, yeah, that. <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. You better behave. <laughs> that's a foul that's a foul man that's a foul Jack what a sportsman I'll just go ahead and shoot the cue ball and we'll move it after that how about that Andy uh, uh, option here. What do you do here, Justin? Uh, can I see the full one? Mm -hmm. Any kind of 95% of it. I think if you can hold the cue ball, I mean, bank the one, out, like stuffing. bank it, and you don't want it to come two, three rails back out to where you the one can see it. Five. 
Maybe you can I try to bank it in the down. six somehow. Either off at two rails or one rail. It's just like, yeah, he was trying to run into the six there. Saw him point at it. That was his intention. Haven't seen play very you. smart. Yeah, look at that timing right there. Oh man, he's at it again. Oh, I'm telling you, we're getting the spam, man. We're making it big time now. Going with the overhand dart method jump here. Doesn't look like he has one of those fancy, uh, fancy jump cues all the cool kids are using nowadays. Looks like he's got to work a bit harder for the jump. Here. Take one. Oh, all right. You uh, you doing okay over there, man? Don't look now. Gosh, didn't sound like you were doing too well for a second, man. You all right? I had an itch. An itch. My soda got stolen. Did it? He just brought it back. <laughs> hey, you got to be careful to run into something over here. I think he's going to cut it aside. Can he see the three? He can. He's trying to trying to cut it aside, but I think he's going to run into something. This is a lot of ask, jump jacking up like this. This is asking a lot out of the shot. Yep. Yeah, you're right. That's a good call there. A lot of traffic down there. Yeah. He was trying to roll up under the nine ball. Bank it. Just bank it out. Six ball. Yeah, that's what I meant. Oh, how about that shot? Wow. Really good there. Two rail or you go for the one round? Uh, looks, looks like, like he's, he's lining up for a one railer. Very tough to judge when the rail is so close. <laughs> Did you see a gap there? I didn't see a gap there. No. Did you mute us again? No, I keep getting I keep getting messages that says that the stream is lagging in quality for a second, and then it goes right back up, and then it says it's lagging, and then it goes right back up, and it's kind of strange. It's been a little sporadic. I think that's on, uh, like Peter says, I think we're just kind of at the mercy of Bullshooter's Wi-Fi from time to time. Sometimes works better than others. Now that the room's starting to fill up, not sure. Curious. I don't know. Um, 
Yeah. Oh, pretty good there. Oh, all right, thanks, Pete. Yeah. Looks like it's a little better now. If it keeps happening, let me know. Try something, maybe get Pete over here, but Yeah. I think it's just a Wi Fi thing right now. Hopefully it clears up in a few minutes. If not, we'll get Peter over here and we'll get him to fix it, but see it's this right and they're not gonna hear you. <laughs> That's true. That is true. Oh, good shot there. Look at Nick trying to bounce back here. Maybe. He's going to turn this into a match. It's, he ain't going to roll over. Nope. Nope. Well, he might. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah, I this something. like seeing I uh, appreciate you, Pete. It means a lot, man. Why we do it for comments like that? Uh, yeah, I took a look at it and fixed it. <laughs> <laughs> Hurts the mastermind behind the process. I think Nick, or yeah, I think Nick's going to fix that and uh, he'll be right in this game. He just took that one for granted. That was the easiest shot of the rack. Not really. But... Yeah, yeah, well. All right, here we go. Back to break. Nick had a good chance to bring put himself back in this match. That's that's the first time I've seen Jack break scratch on the break in a, quite a bit. Awfully surprised by that one. Looked like he tried to put a little extra into that and and, and in return. Lost a little bit of accuracy with this cue ball. I think Nick, Nick needs to pull back the horns a little bit. Slow down just a touch. He'll be right back in there. He absolutely can. He's capable of it. He's not here by accident. He has struggled to get going on these tables. Obviously played, uh... Well... Played very well yesterday. Ah. Uh, see what I'm saying? He's... Really not feeling great over the ball. You can tell he's a bit hesitant over the ball. He's starting to yeah. second guess himself versus relying on more of his the intuition. Look like he was. He's really battling. Nerves might be a little quirky. He's really battling something in his head. You can kind of tell. In between shots, he's going over there. He's. He's working on his bridge hand. He's working on his straight queuing. He's you, you know what Jack's battling with. Oh yeah, Jack's battling with plants in a pretty darn good pool. <laughs> Jack's tough. He's to beat. stroking the ball right now. He really is. He's uh, looks like we're drumming up some action for the finals. Yeah, let's hear it. I'm not going to participate. Uh, yeah, let's. I'm going to be unbiased coming into it, but I'd love to hear all the action yeah, and the I, comments. Oh, Let's I know hear. it's going to be a good one. It's going to be a loser. Oh, yeah. It's, I think, I think, I'm I think the final is going to be a blow for blow. Great finals. It's going to be a lot of fun to watch. Yeah, you know how they call you Mr. 100%. Oh, yeah. 
I'm going to start making Thanks up so words. Much. You're going to start what? Just making up words. <laughs> and use them in, as analogies. <laughs> Jesus. Well, there, this is some service here. What happened there? Well, he, Jack's over here playing in semifinals. Yep. And his brother comes over and hands him a little candy bar and a little Reese's for a snack. <laughs> <laughs> that is awesome. Oh, yeah, dude. Perks that of the job, awesome. man. Everyone treats us. I mean, everyone's that been so, awesome. so good to us. Really appreciate everyone for tuning in and then being a part of this. Good shot there from Nick. But you know it's all about the players on the table, but we appreciate you uh, giving us company as well. Is that a tournament too? What's this one? Todd Rowitz. Uh, so we got, so we have, his name is, uh, Matt Hardwick, I believe is, is how you pronounce his last name. He is, uh, from California. he's from Southern California. He beat, he's the one that beat Jack nine to three, correct? Was that him? No, but yeah. he beat, yep. he beat Nick Sapiti. Nick, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, for the hot beat. beat. Who was the one that beat Jack? I forgot. Jack beat Jack? Jack beat Jack for sure, but. Who else beat Jack? Um, oh, sounds like Rich is saying Matt. I think it was Matt. Yeah, it may have been. Matt's been yeah, on the Matt tear. put him to the loser side, and then Jack had to play on the loser side a couple matches mm -hmm. for a while. Mm -hmm. So Matt's just been on a, on an absolute tear then. Oh, so Matt beat Jack and Nick. Makes sense. Oh, oh, I like that shot. I really like that. Is it to come back around? Oh, yeah. With that? Yeah. That's awesome. Football and basketball. Oh, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> You got a girlfriend over there, Kurt? No. Like she was hitting on you, dude. No, she, she was. A, <laughs> she was amazed. She was looking at you, man. No, we're sitting here watching a tournament, and that we've got the laptop here with the screen open. And she thought we were watching. Things go kind of back and forth. Just make sure you don't crash. Now, when you come back and forth, are you coming above the side pocket, or are you staying on the same straight, line it's on? Straight back. Okay. I don't mind leaving myself a little bit more distance. Uh, first chink in the armor there from Jack that we've seen in a little bit. He's missed a couple, but no, nothing like that. Final on Justin and Jack. Jack uh, put on an absolute <laughs> clinic against Justin. Beat him 9-1. to one. I believe it wasn't nine two, was it? It was nine one. It's nine one or nine two, I believe. Yeah. Just really played good against them. Well, I don't think. All right. Let's go ahead and turn the volume off while they announce their dart. <laughs> What? I don't think they're loud enough. Oh, looks like our Facebook stream stopped. Like we lost the stream. 
It wasn't me. I didn't do it. I promise. 